The state of Indiana tonight is looking into high-tech ways to help protect crumbling roads and bridges. RTV6's Jason Fechner has details on NDOT's new pilot program. Well, we are under I-65 downtown right now, and hard to believe that an overweight truck above us could cause roughly as much damage as 10,000 vehicles. Now a new pilot program in the state of Indiana could force the owners of those overweight trucks to help cover the cost of any damage they do to the state's infrastructure. Amidst promises at the state house to fix Indiana's crumbling roads and bridges in 2016. Pavement degradation is more accelerated than, than what the engineers anticipated. A new plan from INDOT to track and potentially find the owners of overweight trucks wearing out Indiana's infrastructure. The challenge with overweight vehicles is really twofold. You know, they can cause very specific damage to a structure, but they can also accelerate degradation. New in-road weight sensors will trigger cameras along I-94 in LaPorte County. 10,000 trucks use it every day, and the owners will first get a warning and possibly a fine down the road if lawmakers sign off on it. The pilot program during 2016 will allow us to gather some data to see how this works in a, in a real-time deployed environment. Uh, but ultimately, what we would like to do is take what NDOT learns over the next few months, give that data to, uh, to the state legislature, and allow them to make a really informed decision about how we can modernize our, our enforcement technique. If that pilot program is successful in northern Indiana, there is no timetable yet for when it could be rolled out statewide. In Indianapolis, Jason Fechner, RTV6.